Imagine a world where autonomous robots aren't just helping with everyday tasks. They're fighting on the front lines, making split-second decisions, and even entertaining us. In today's video, we're diving into the shocking future of warfare, where robots like the Phantom MK1 are being trained to become the first autonomous soldier bots. But that's not all. This isn't just about military robots. We're talking about a game-changing plan to build an entire army of them. Stick around, because you won't believe how this technology is set to reshape not only defense, but industries, entertainment, and even our everyday lives. But before we move on, do you know what is the name of the current most powerful computer in the world? Is it Aurora, Leonardo, El Capitan, or Frontier? Let us know in the comments below. Foundation Robotics Labs unveiled the Phantom MK1, a humanoid robot designed for military applications, industrial tasks, and entertainment in February 2025. The company showcased the robot's versatility by featuring it in a 30-minute DJ set at San Francisco's Temple Nightclub during the Tech Giga Party event. This appearance highlighted the Phantom MK1's capabilities beyond its intended defense roles, sparking discussions about the multifaceted applications of humanoid robots. But DJing was the last thing the Phantom MK1 would be doing once the company began mass-producing them. Foundation Robotics Labs, the innovative company behind the Phantom MK1, is making waves with its ambitious vision for the future of robotics. Founded in 2024 by Sanket Pathak, Arjun Sethi, and Mike LeBlanc, the company is pushing the boundaries of what autonomous robots can do, especially in high-risk environments like military zones. Their mission? To revolutionize industries, reduce human risk in conflict zones, and unlock new levels of productivity by building robots that can handle the heavy lifting in areas where human workers or soldiers are vulnerable. The Phantom MK1, unveiled in February 2025, is a key part of this vision. Initially designed as a military-grade robot for smashing that like button, just like you should, if you haven't done so already. But no, in all seriousness, it was designed for defense purposes. It has already garnered attention for its multifaceted potential. This humanoid robot isn't just about combat, though. It made its debut in a surprising way at San Francisco's Temple Nightclub, where it performed a 30-minute DJ set at a tech event, blending the cutting edge with the unexpected. This moment demonstrated that Foundation Robotics Labs isn't just thinking about the military applications of robots, but also how they can function in more entertaining, everyday environments. It's clear the company is aiming to create robots that are flexible and adaptable in various aspects of life, from defense to entertainment entertainment. What makes the Phantom MK1 particularly interesting is that it could be the first autonomous soldier bot, setting the stage for a new era of warfare and defense technology. Autonomous soldier bots like the Phantom MK1 would be designed to carry out combat operations without direct human control, relying on artificial intelligence to make decisions and execute tasks with precision and speed. Imagine a battlefield where human soldiers are protected by robots that can neutralize threats, scout dangerous areas, and perform complex missions autonomously. That's the Vision Foundation Robotics Labs is bringing to life, and it could forever change how we think about defense and robotics in general. The Phantom MK1 could become a key player in military operations, reducing casualties, improving mission outcomes, and even handling logistics in war zones. But beyond the military, these kinds of robots could revolutionize other industries too, from search and rescue to even everyday tasks as the technology matures. The Phantom MK1 isn't just a symbol of where robotics is headed, it's a glimpse into a future where autonomous robots take on critical roles in society. So how does the first autonomous robotic soldier actually work? The fact that the Phantom MK1 is equipped with advanced AI and deep learning algorithms is expected, but the robot also has a sophisticated set of sensors that allow it to see and understand its environment. The Phantom MK1, developed by Foundation Robotics Labs, is a humanoid robot designed for a variety of applications, including military service, industrial tasks, and entertainment. Standing 5 feet 9 inches, 1.75 meters, tall and weighing 176 pounds, 80 kilograms, it is built to handle tasks requiring both strength and precision. The robot's frame is designed to support a payload of up to 44 pounds, 20 kilograms, allowing it to lift and carry substantial weights. One of the key features of the Phantom MK1 is its proprietary cycloid actuators, which deliver the performance of hydraulic systems while maintaining the efficiency and quiet operation of electric motors. These actuators provide a peak torque of 160 newton meters, enabling the robot to perform tasks that demand both dexterity and strength. Its lower torso is engineered for mobility and stability, equipped with advanced actuators and a sophisticated balance system. This configuration enables the robot to navigate stairs, traverse uneven terrain, and move through confined spaces, 
making it adaptable to various settings such as offices, warehouses, and disaster zones. The Phantom MK1's modular design allows for easy upgrades, ensuring that it remains up to date with the latest advancements in robotics technology. This flexibility positions the Phantom MK1 as a versatile and reliable solution for a wide range of applications, from military operations to industrial and entertainment sectors. The Phantom MK1 is really something special because of its autonomy. Instead of being remotely controlled, it can operate independently making rapid decisions based on real-time data it collects from its surroundings. This makes it perfect for situations where human soldiers might be at risk, as it can carry out dangerous missions with minimal human involvement. The robot's AI helps it assess threats, navigate obstacles, and even make tactical decisions in the heat of the moment. Training the Phantom MK-1 for its role as an autonomous soldier involves a mix of simulated and real-world scenarios. Foundation Robotics Labs runs advanced simulations that replicate combat situations, allowing the robot to practice its decision-making skills in virtual environments. These simulations cover everything from urban warfare to battlefield reconnaissance, helping the robot learn to recognize different threats and navigate through tricky terrain. But simulations aren't enough. They also test the robot in real-world conditions, placing it in controlled environments that mimic combat zones. This helps the Phantom MK-1 adapt to unpredictable elements like weather and moving targets. The company is not just focused on the robot's physical skills, though. They're making sure the Phantom MK-1 operates within the ethical guidelines of warfare. It's being trained to follow international laws, distinguish between combatants and civilians, and minimize damage to non-combatants. This ethical programming is crucial because the idea is to eventually deploy these robots in real military operations, where they will be expected to make life or death decisions autonomously. Beyond that, Foundation Robotics Labs wants the Phantom MK-1 to collaborate with human soldiers. It's not just a tool, it's meant to be a team member, sharing intelligence, following commands, and even helping make strategic decisions in the field. The company is developing the robot's ability to learn from both simulations and real-world experiences, so it can continuously improve its performance. This means that over time, the Phantom MK-1 will become even more effective at its job, adjusting its strategies based on new information and scenarios. What makes this all even more fascinating is that Foundation Robotics Lab sees the Phantom MK-1 as the first step toward creating fully autonomous soldier bots, these robots are designed to carry out missions that are too dangerous or tedious for humans, whether that's scouting enemy positions, defending military bases, or providing support during combat operations. The end goal is for robots like the Phantom MK-1 to work alongside human soldiers, taking on critical roles in military operations, all while reducing the risk to human life. This vision could transform how wars are fought and how we think about using technology in defense. The Phantom MK-1 is just the beginning, and Foundation Robotics Labs is aiming to lead the way in creating a future where autonomous robots are an essential part of military strategy. How will they do this? Foundation Robotics Labs has expressed intentions to develop a fleet of autonomous robots, with plans to produce up to 100,000 humanoid robots over the next four years. This ambitious initiative aims to integrate these robots into various sectors, including national defense, manufacturing, and warehousing. In the defense sector, the company is focusing on creating robots capable of performing tasks such as maintenance and aircraft refueling. Notably, Foundation Robotics Labs distinguishes itself by openly developing military-grade robots, unlike some competitors that avoid weaponizing their products. While specific details about the timeline and scale of deploying an autonomous robot army remain undisclosed, Foundation Robotics Labs continues to advance its research and development efforts. This aligns with broader industry trends, as evidenced by the U.S. Army's ongoing experiments with integrating robotic systems into military units, aiming to enhance operational capabilities and soldier safety. Here's another video AI enthusiasts loved watching. This is AI Exposed, demystifying the world of artificial intelligence, one video at a time. 